this is a uh, a brief uh, update on the Pirate, Pittsburgh Pirates offseason for all the novice fans out there, for all the naive fans that, they, you know, they're still drinking the Pirate Kool-Aid. As usual, the Pirates have basically done nothing in this offseason. They re-signed their own free agent, Jung Ho Gong. They didn't want to give him the five and a half mil. They gave him three. They signed Lonnie Chisenhall. But they basically saved $10 million by uh, not picking up the option on Jay Hay. They saved, uh, what do you make last year, six? Six million on Mercer. You traded Nova, you save another nine million. They're going to trade Cervelli to save another 11 and a half. I don't have a problem getting rid of players, okay? Yeah, but uh, the thing I do have a problem with is when the money is not put back in the product, okay? And then the signature statement of the Pittsburgh Pirates starts with Frank Coonley. You know, Frank's the voice of the Pirates. He's the he's the guy that, you know, everyone wants to believe, but you can't do it because he's, he lies. He's a liar. He vehemently lies, okay? Uh, they put up nets across the dugout two weeks before the season two years ago. Frank didn't tell you, but they knew four months in advance. But their signature statement is, we're trying to win a world championship, and anything less is not acceptable. Now, if you believe in that, you believe in the two-third, okay? That's total bullshit. With Bob Nutting, the number one priority is the bottom line, making as much money as possible, milking the product, so to speak. You had the lowest payroll in 23 years since 1996, so they lower the payroll to get all their lost revenue back. These are facts, okay? I'm just stating the facts, simple. Now, you can go believe this bullshit if you want, that Pirates have this great pitching staff they could compete. I'm not saying they can't compete, but it's going to be very hard to win a division when you're not fully committed. Okay, and the Pirates are not fully committed. So I'll, I'll go up against anyone with this statement. So hope everyone has a nice, healthy, and healthy new year. And happy holidays to you and yours. Peace out.